Hello dear students and welcome to this online class video. This is the first part of the 6th chapter B my multiple. I will be your factor of class 5 subject mathematics. Let's start the class. Now let's know the topics of today's class. So the first topic is the mouse and the cat. It's a story based on multiple. And the second topic is who is Monto waiting for? It's a puzzle game. And the third is new game. Now here are two basic questions in your mind that you wanted to ask to me that sir uh, what is multiple and what is factor so dear friends relax at last I will explain but before understand multiple we have to do some activities and understand solve some puzzle so come to the first topic that is the mouse and the cat as I have told you it's a story based on uh, multiple so start with this story the hungry cat is trying to catch Kunjan the mouse. Kunjan is now on 14th step. It can jump two steps at a time. The cat is on the third step. She can jump three steps at a time. If the mouse reaches 28, it can hide in the hole. Find out whether the mouse can get away safely. So come to the picture to understand this story. So here is the mouse, uh, sorry, here is the cat. Uh, who is on 3 and it takes 3 steps in 1 jump at a time for example here the cat is on 3 so if it will take a, a jump so it will uh, the cat will go on 6 then in next jump on 9 he will go now similarly here is the Kunjan the mouse and it takes 2 steps in one jump at one time so he is on 14 so in the next if he will take next jump so he will come on yeah 16 then in next step he will go on 18 then 20 in this way uh, you can point it so now we have to come to the first question the steps on which the mouse jumps so first the mouse is on 14 so in the next step he will go on 16 you can write 16 here then next number will be 18 why because it takes two steps in one jump at one time so what is the gap between 16 and 18 yeah 2 so write the numbers which have two uh, gap of 2 so 16 18 then 20 then 22 then 24 then 26 then 28 okay so on 28 there is a hole remember it and now the next question is the steps on which the cat jumps so steps for uh, cat we will write here so the uh, cat was on 3 so next number will come 6 then 9 then 12 then 15 then 18 and at last 21 24 27 and at last 30 so there is no 30 so now count the jumps okay then we can say that the cat is catching the mouse or not so in how many steps means in how many jumps the mouse got the hole means on 28 there was a hole so now count the jumps for the mouse so one jump two three four five six and seven so in seventh jump the mouse go to the hole so now count the jumps for the cat 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and this is 8 so on seventh the on seventh jump the cat was on 24 and on seventh jump the mouse was on 28 and on 28 there was a hole it means the mouse was what safely went to the hole next is the cat sorry the steps on which both cat and the mouse jumps so there were only two numbers the first was 18 and the second was 24 and at last can the mouse get away yes we have already answered this the mouse was safely get away now next find out if the cat starts from fifth step and jumps five steps at a time the mouse starts from eighth and jumps 
फोर स्टेप्स एट अ टाइम कैन दे कैन द माउस गेट अवे सो फॉर दिस वी हैव टू राइट द नंबर फॉर कैट द कैट वॉज ऑन फाइव एंड इट टेक्स फाइव स्टेप्स इन वन जम्प एट अ टाइम सो नेक्स्ट विल बी टेन देन फिफ्टीन देन ट्वेंटी देन ट्वेंटी फाइव ओके नाउ राइट द स्टेप्स फॉर माउस सो द माउस वॉज ऑन एट लेट मी राइट यूर द माउस वॉज यूर एट ओके एंड इट टेक्स हाउ मेनी स्टेप्स फोर स्टेप्स इन वन जम्प सो एट देन नेक्स्ट नंबर विल बी ट्वेल्व देन सिक्सटीन देन ट्वेंटी देन ट्वेंटी फोर सो नाउ काउंट द स्टेप्स फॉर द माउस दैट इन हाउ मेनी मीन्स देर वॉज अ होल ऑन ट्वेंटी एट रिमेंबर सो टिल ट्वेंटी एट वी हैव टू राइट दिस देन नेक्स्ट विल बी ट्वेंटी एट एंड हियर ट्वेंटी फाइव देन इट इज थर्टी सो काउंट द जम्प्स फॉर द माउस हियर इज वन टू थ्री फोर एंड फाइव इन फिफ्थ जम्प ही इज गोइंग टू मीन्स द माउस इज गोइंग टू द होल एंड हियर ऑन ट्वेंटी यू कैन सी हेयर इज ट्वेंटी एंड हेयर इज ऑल्सो ट्वेंटी फॉर द कैट सो इन ट्वेंटी द कैट इज कैचिंग द माउस मीन्स इन हाउ मेनी जम्प वन टू एंड थ्री सो इन थर्ड जम्प द कैट इज कैचिंग द माउस मीन्स इन दिस कंडीशन द माउस कैन नॉट गेट अवे सो इन विच स्टेप इन ट्वेंटी विच वॉज द थर्ड जम्प फॉर द कैट now in the next page we have the second topic that is who is monto waiting for so let's read it monto cat is waiting for somebody do you know for whom he is waiting we don't know there is a trick to find it so we have a puzzle with numbers from 1 to 60 you can see here 1 to 60 we have numbers and there is a name you can see the letters m d x p i so we have letters so it means they make a name so how to find the name for this we have a uh, some questions here mark the mark with a red dot all numbers which can divided by 2 so dear student can you tell me which numbers are divisible by 2 yes only and only even numbers are div uh, divisible by 2 so we have to put a red dot on that numbers the second is mark a yellow dot on the numbers which can divided by 3 so which numbers are divisible by 3 yes the sum of the uh, digits of the number if 3 and uh, are divisible by 3 so that number will be also divisible by 3 and blue dot for the numbers which are divided by 4 if the last two numbers means last two digits of a number is divided by uh, Four, so that means the whole number will be divided by four. So we have to put a red dot for two if the number is divided by three, uh, two, and uh, yellow dot for the numbers if that number is divided by three, and blue dot for the numbers if that divided by four. So for two, at first we will do this. So let me take the red color. So I have taken the red color. So come to one. One is not a uh, uh, divisible by two. So leave this. Now two is also divided by two. So put a dot here. Two. Then three is not. So put a dot four. Then on six. Then eight. Then ten. Because this number are divisible by two. Only even numbers. So just put a dot on the red dot on the even numbers. Then twelve, then fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, and twenty. It will be very uh, easy to find out the numbers which are divisible by two. Why? Because only you have to find the even numbers, and you very well uh, about the you know very well about the even numbers. So on twenty-two, then twenty-four, then twenty-six, then twenty-eight, then thirty, then thirty-two, thirty-four. 
58 and at last 60 now you have to put a yellow dot for the numbers which are divisible by uh, 3 so let me take the yellow color so here I don't have so let me take another color green color I am taking so which numbers are divisible by 3 so here you can you have numbers from 1 to 60 so you will just read the table of 3 okay because the numbers which come on the table of 3 that will be divisible by 3 so first is 3 so put a dot here then 6 remember 6 has 2 colors now then 9 then 12 then 15 then 18 then 21 then 24 then 27 then 30 means you have you can take 3 3 uh, steps then you can go for 33 then 36 39 then you will go 42 then 45 48 then 51 54 and uh, 57 and at last you will get 60 so now we have to put uh, another blue dot for the numbers which are divisible by 4 so similarly you can take 4 4 steps to find the numbers which are divisible by 4 so first will be 4 then 8 then 12 16 20 24 28 32 36 then 40 then 44 then 48 then 52 and uh, 56 then last 60 so now the next question is uh, which are the boxes which have dots of all three colors so we have to find out the numbers which are in all these three colors so here you can see the first number is M it has three colors so now write here M now another one is uh, the next number will get yeah 24 you can see it has red green and blue so it is O so you can write here O next number we are going to find that is 32 sorry not 32 uh, 36 yes U so here is a letter that is U so write here U then next we have three colors on which number 48 and the letter is S so write here S letter and at last you will have another three colors on the last number that is 60 and the letter is E so the next question is write those letters below in order so we have write in order M O U S C. so which name is this this is mouse it means the monto cat was waiting for the mouse oh now we have solved this puzzle now dear students come to the next topic that is new game so how to play this new game let me explain this game in a short way actually uh, here you can see one two three four five and six six uh, children are here so what will happen this is the first second this is third fourth and fifth and this is sixth so first number children will call out the number from one okay one then second will call out two then here is the third children the third child but he will or she will not tell three as the number he will just say mu you can see here mu okay if he will say three so he will be out and for the number in the place of 3 he has to say mu ok means all the numbers which are divisible by uh, 3 that all numbers that the children have to say mu for example another children then will say 4 the next 5 but in the place of 6 the child have, has to say, say uh, mu ok similarly in 7 8 they will uh, call out the number 7 and 8 then in the place of 9 the next child will say mu 
if he is not saying mu so he will be out okay so in this way at last you can find you the winner so here you can see numbers 369 the what will come the another number yeah 12 15 then next is 18 21 and so on so we say these numbers are the multiples of 3 so these numbers mean 3 6 9 12 15 18 21 so these numbers are multiples of 3 so to understand this uh, multiple I am going to explain this all so you, here you can see that the numbers from 3 to 21 means 3 6 9 12 15 18 21 this all numbers are divisible by 3 yes so these numbers will be known as multiples of 3 so to understand this I am showing you the picture so I have taken this multiple topic out of the textbook means from the another book I have taken this so multiples the topic is multiple so what is the definition of multiple here I am I am going to tell you so a multiple is a number which can be divided by another numbers without any remainder it is very important without any remainder okay so that will be known as multiples for example 12 so 12 is a multiple of 3 and also 4 because 12 is divisible by 3 and 4 for that 12 is divisible uh, sorry multiples of 3 and 4 and uh, 6 is multiple of 2 and 3 because 6 is divisible by 2 and also divisible by 3 some more examples are here 9 is the multiple of 3 and 9 and also 3 has many multiples 3 6 9 12 yes before sometimes we have seen this all now uh, there is a question that how you will find the multiple numbers so here is a very easy way you have to multiply the counting numbers okay 1 2 3 4 5 6 8 with the numbers where you are going to find the multiples so for example if you are if you uh, you have to find the multiples of 4 so what you have to do you have to multiply 1 with 4 then 2 multiply with uh, 4 then 3 multiply with 4 so then you will get the multiples so the first multiple of 4 will be 4 when you will multiply by 1 uh, let me show you so 4 1 4 then 2 you will multiply with 4 so you will get 8 then when you will multiply 3 with 4 so you will get 12 and in this way many numbers many multiples you will get so there are uh, not limited multiples of a number there are infinite multiples of a number remember this point and two more important point that uh, every multiple other than zero of a number is either greater than or equal to the number okay and the second is zero is a multiple of every number so in this way multiple topic is clear i hope that you all have very well understand but before uh, leaving this class i have question for you all that you have to write the multiples minimum five multiples of 13 and also of 17 of these two numbers you have to write the minimum five five multiples five multiples for 13 and five multiples of 17 write in the comment box don't forget it and at last i want to say do like share and subscribe this channel now time to say goodbye children